Welcome back everyone to Moons and Pearls. I am so thankful for each and every one of you guys. Um, I want to make sure you guys know how loved and appreciative I am of all of you guys. So if you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share, subscribe, get us closer to that 1000. We're almost there because then I'll be able to go live and I could do some short uh, free readings for you guys. So that's coming up soon. Um, I'm going to do um, a general reading for fire signs, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. So take what resonates, leave what doesn't, you guys. Um, I'm doing all these messages with love, care, and sending you guys all positive energy as much as I can. So Spirit, tell me what's in the current energy for my fire signs. What's in the current energy for my fire signs? So how are you guys? Thank you for all the sweet comments. I really, really appreciate it. Um, you guys, I feel like you're, I, I see a lot of darkness for some of you, um, but not in a bad way. I feel like you're working through your shadow side. Um, you're learning to set boundaries. Um, I also see there might be two people involved around you um, that you may be unsure about. You're going through a transformation, yeah. You see, we have all these cards and they all have a lot of darkness behind them. But the thing about this darkness is a time of rebirth, okay? You are birthing yourself again. You're going through a strong change. And this card, just look at the fierce look of this person and the eye snake. So I feel like you're being confronted um, to face your fears and not be afraid. Um, and you'll, this rebirth, I feel like you are definitely working on a transformation. And this has to do with your higher self. Like, you know, what, um, what are the right things that you have to do? What do you need to change? Um, there's also desire, but you have to find a desire to motivate you to do something in your life, right? That's the driving force when you start doing things. It can help you complete creative work or bring new things to life. It can be the one and only thing that keeps you going after setbacks on the road to your goals. It is the why of the work that you do in the world. What is your why? What are your passions and are you expressing them? So. What, what are your desires? What are your passions? Why do you like that? And um, try to go back to, to all of that. That's the essence of you. So let's see here, Fire Signs, what's happened in the recent past for you guys. Recent past for Fire Signs. Recent past. I feel like you don't wanna fight anymore. And even though you've tried setting boundaries, um, you're pushing people, things, comments away. Um, definitely a tower moment. Uh, definitely a feeling of what the boop is going on. Um, things not working out. Um, just chaos. It kind of feels like a lot of chaotic energy. Um, and not moving towards anything or anyone. I feel like your energy is stagnant. Um, I don't know if there's an older person, um, an older woman trying to advise you at this time. I see this here as well, who is giving you the strength, I feel like, in this recent past. Spirit, tell me more about this tower moment and this defensiveness. These cards here. So I feel that because of, of, of this situation, these tower moments, um, there's been, yeah, um, a fire sign. I feel like you haven't been able to give because your cups are empty. You're empty, you're, you're depleted. And so you, what's happened here, there's been a pull of emotion um, because there's, there's, I feel like a want or a need to, to be okay, to, to feel satisfied, to not have to fight anymore. Um, I feel like there's someone who's re regretful 
of how things have turned out so far. Um, there's nostalgia here about memories. Spirit, tell me more about these memories. Yeah, there's just a feeling of, of not feeling successful, a feeling, a feeling like a feeling of a feeling, just feeling like a failure. But we don't fail. We learn lessons, right? When we don't try, that's when we fail. But if you've tried, um, I feel like it's fair to say it was a lesson. You have to walk away with a lesson. There is, though, um, an energy, like a really sweet energy around you guys that you're... <sighs> I don't know it's like a feeling of you or your person like they've done something wrong or they've done something bad so they want to like give you something small to make you happy um it's not a big offer um it's a small offer that i see here but i feel like it's genuine or the, like you're starting you or your person are starting to say things um like trying to show you a little bit of emotion but there's still someone in a dark energy because they made a decision. Somebody's regretting a decision that they made. Tell me spirit about this decision. Somebody, oh man. Okay, so here's what we have. Somebody is regretful of making a decision. I feel like somebody wants to return somewhere. Um, I feel like now, someone's gained clarity of a situation they understand a connection or they're understanding a certain something in their life that something was unfair something that they did was unfair whether it was you or your person but somebody's in regret about a decision that was taken to walk away but th there's a possible return here um let's see spirit what's coming towards my fire signs oh man there's heartbreak, defensiveness. I think there's fear of making a decision, as a fear of getting hurt. But um, with this heart here coming, crossing, I feel like definitely healing is on the horizon, and good news are good news is coming towards you. Okay, um, and I feel like you're defensive because of this all of this darkness that you've been through, it's made you like close off to the world, um, fire signs, but everything's gonna be okay. There's good news coming towards you. Um, let's hear about this good news, fire signs. What's going on with this good news? Yeah, there's a, there's a return somewhere, something like that. Um, and there's a lot of praying. I, I feel and I sense there's a lot of praying. So. Um, if it's meant to be or if it's something that God is blessing, I feel like it will be okay. But again, everybody has free will to do as they wish. So I'm not saying you have to, just, just a messenger, you guys. Finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Let's see what else is coming for finances. Let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. One more spirit. And it's just, I feel like there's feelings and somebody's not making the effort. Like that King of Cups is with holding their emotions, what they thoroughly feel because of all the darkness, everything that's happened um, to them. But let's see what um, messages we have from the angels. If you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share, subscribe. So I know to come back and do these messages for you guys. No need to worry, okay? Your energy uh, is just as powerful. The more you worry, the more you worry, the more you worry. So um, think positively in the near future. So whatever you're asking for, you're going to get it very soon and get more information before making final decisions, okay? Let me see one more. For you guys and um, be assertive if you believe so i feel like you true you thoroughly and truly have to believe in your healing power and your worth and um your ability to manifest and create the life that you really want 
So I want to read the No Need to Worry for you guys because I think that's really important if you're not feeling very optimistic. So your worries and concerns regarding your questions are unnecessary. Your angels have the situation well in hand and everything is going to turn out perfectly. Obsessing over this subject isn't helpful. The energy of fear and worry only slows the eventual manifesting of your desires. Visualize loving and happy outcomes and keep your thoughts positive. Very soon, you will wonder why you were worrying about this all. And we did have the card of in the near future. So very soon, things are going to change as long as you, you're you able to change that, um, that energy, energy. If any of this um, resonated, make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment, so I know to come back and do more of these readings for you guys. Have a good one. Ciao.